everyone, this is Human Shezadi, and in this video, I'm going to show a brief introduction of Mimic software to you guys. This video will help you to get it started with the software in a short time, so stay tuned. This is the GUI environment of the software, including axial, coronal, and sagittal view of your images. In the bottom right view is the 3D window, which will contain all of the 3D models we're going to create. On the right hand side of the GUI is the project management tab with the three different tabs. Images, masks, and the measurements we can make. Underneath the project management is a small toolbar with some functions to use for the masks, like the calculate part, clear mask, duplicate mask, and so on. For instance, uh, the calculate part will calculate 3D objects from the mask. This object will then appear in the screen below. So in the calculate part, usually you need to choose optimal as the quality and then hit the calculate. Also, if you want to import a mesh model into Mimix, you need to paste the model in here. And then a finite element method tab, FEM tab, will appear here. Then you can apply material properties on the model, which I've already showed you guys in a previous video I made. At the bottom of the GUI, you can see the logger, which this keeps tracks of all the actions here we perform. In the volume rendering tab, we can modulate the windowing of our images. You can do this by manually dragging one point to another point, like this. Or by using predefined sets for CD scans. If you scroll down here, you can see some options, which if you're going to make a 3D model for a bone, it's better to choose this as a bone. At the top of the screen, you can see some feature each with different set of functions. For instance, if you want to change the view of the images, you can use the view tab here to zoom in and out or pan the image. Also, you can hold the circle on a view plane like axial plane and then hit the escape bar to make one view full screen. And escape bar again. Another way to zoom in and out is to hold Ctrl key and right click and drag up and down. Like this. Also, if you left click anywhere on an image, the other two images will adjust to that location. You can also change the brightness by right clicking and dragging the point from left to right, like this. Or the contrast by right clicking and dragging the point up and down like this to navigate through images you can use the sliders on the right or you can scroll with your mouse hope this very quick video would be helpful for you guys we welcome your comments on this and be happy to answer any questions you might have as well. Bye till the next video.